Welcome to 5-Minute Photo. I'm Bill Ferris. The objective of 5-Minute Photo is that in the next 5 minutes, I'll give you information that can help you get more enjoyment out of photography. Whether that's a tip about a new product or a photographic technique, in the next 5 minutes, my goal is to share with you information that will help you get more from your photography. Today, we're continuing to work with Peak Design's hotly anticipated new product, the Capture Camera Clip version 2. So let me start my five minute watch right now. All right, Capture Camera Clip version two. I'm one of the folks who supported this project on Kickstarter and as part of my commitment, what I ordered and received was the Capture Camera Clip Pro version two system. And let me give you a demonstration of that. So this is the camera Capture Clip version two. It's machined aluminum. And I gotta tell you, I discovered something really cool about this product. When I was researching it online initially, one of the comments that I read about version one of this system was that these bolts which connect the mounting plate to the base plate of the capture camera clip system were too short. And a number of folks would say, you know, I try to use this with the strap of my backpack or the belt strap of my backpack and the strap is so thick that with these bolts, they're just a little bit too short. And if you guys could just give us longer bolts, then it would work with this system. So, just a few minutes ago, I'm trying this on with my day pack, and I'm realizing, yeah, these bolts are still pretty short. And I'm thinking, I wish Peak Design had sent me some longer clips. Well, I look around with the materials I was setting, of course, what I find are these longer these longer bolts that I've got in the capture camera clip system right here and so in this bag these are the original bolts that came with it the shorter bolts I'm just going to set them aside and we'll uh, continue to use the uh, longer bolts with the capture camera clip pro so the first thing I'm going to do is uh, go ahead and just slide this on the waist belt of my backpack I'm going to slide the base plate through the straps. I'm going to tighten these bolts. While I'm doing that, I'll tell you I also ordered the Pro Pad. The Pro Pad is one of the products we'll be seeing also today. With the longer bolts, it takes just a few extra turns to get them nice and snug. There we go. Okay, now we'll take my camera. Uh, I shoot with a DX format uh, or APS-C format, uh, Nikon D90. And as you can see on the bottom, I've mounted the Arca plate that came with uh, my system. And uh, again, Peak Designs included this little uh, Allen wrench that I used to tighten the Arca plate onto the bottom of the camera. And all I have to do is slide this in place, it locks in place, let go of my hands, and it's nice and secure and snug. Okay, nice and secure and snug. There's a lock button on the bottom, boom, the camera's ready to be used. Now, I mentioned that I have the Pro Pad, and so let's get the Pro Pad involved in this. So I'm gonna loosen these bolts so we can get the capture camera clip off. Take a look at the pro pad so the pro pad you can see it's padded on the back side and then it's got this flap right here so what i'm going to do is i'm going to open the flap slide this down here between the belt okay and what i'm going to do is slide the base plate through until it comes out the other side bring the top plate over loosen this longer bolt. Now with the longer bolt, this is just so easy to do. I'm going to snug this up here against the belt, the waist belt of my Osprey pack. Tighten these bolts. That's really snug now. Take the camera, lock it in place. Again, camera is secure right here, ready to go. I can walk around, I can move around, and I'm completely confident in the security of this system. Uh, you know, I've seen in the demo videos that Peak Design produced that you can use one hand to release and get your camera. I'm going to go ahead and use two with one hand, push the release button, 
lift up with the other and uh, there we go got the camera out I'm a new user it took me a little while okay let's demonstrate the this system on the shoulder strap okay so I'm going to loosen the bolts get this guy out of here okay so what we're going to do is we're going to just put this pad right underneath the shoulder strap I'm going to slide this through again so it comes out above the top strap okay loosen these uh, bolts again this will take just a few minutes and again keep in mind I'm a new user literally I, this is the second time that I have affixed this to my backpack shoulder strap okay so I'm not a seasoned pro with this device at all but you can see it's really user intuitive and now lock it in place and again the camera is perfect perfectly secure on the shoulder strap of my pack and again I have total confidence in this it's just a really well made uh, piece of kit and it's something that I am very much looking forward to using uh, in my hiking and backpacking and my photography